Hello YouTube and good morning. I'm still in Trotwood, Ohio. Well, I'm near the, I'm on the Great Miami Mitigation Bank and apparently this is a second part of the mitigation bank right down here. So this is land that was going to be turned into a landfill years ago. I filmed the southern end of the, of the mitigation bank but anyway this was going to be a land that was going to be turned into a dump site about 10 years ago I'm, I'm actually glad I'm able to get down here because there's nothing to obstruct to obstruct anything right down here so ultimately what's going to happen this is ultimately getting the property secured as a conservation area is often the first step in uh in in a in a piece of land becoming the metro it be becoming a metro park you can see this is a beautiful area right down here this is beautiful countryside a real pretty pond right over here this is just it and you know this would have been a shame for this to have been a landfill because I mean although Trotwood has had its issues with crime and other things this part of Trotwood is is is, is really beautiful so eventually this is gonna become a metro park and there's a pond that's right down that way so this is ultimately you know the first step you know in and uh and, and a piece of property becoming a metro park so obviously the land that extends i guess further down that way beyond that will also be a metro park i believe i i i, I unfortunately could not get close enough to the entrance on the other side because i just there were some german shepherds that, that looked like they were came from police dog lines and you really it's probably not a good idea to be on foot with them around if you know in the middle of the country but anyway this is a beautiful area and somebody's house over here but I'm not gonna get too close to their house I believe it's their house that so ultimately I assume that house is still occupied I really can't tell but I'm not gonna get too close so ultimately this land will ultimately is already well on its way to becoming a a metro park hopefully at some point in the next five or ten or fifteen years but you can see just nice prairies good wetlands they're letting the grass grow so in that way it's a good area and uh and also sycamore state park is just to the to the north of this as well and the and the reason why that is a state park instead of five rivers own it i guess there was a story years ago that uh that the that they that whoever owned the land wanted too much for it and five rivers did not want to buy that but i guess if they ever needed it to be sold now it could be but it don't matter at all it's all paid for with government money whether it's the state or the local county park district so this is a really beautiful area and a real beautiful area. The the air the road that I rode down to get to this area, Snyder Road, it's real quiet. There was not a single car on the street, but the road to get there is in really just horrendous is in really just horrendous condition the the street to get there. I mentioned Sycamore State Park. I am not gonna I am not going to cover that today. I'll do that on another time because it's really too darn hot. It's going to be too darn hot. It could be storming today. I'll, I'll, I'll cover that some other time coming out this way. So yeah, this is a beautiful area that's hopefully become a metro park. I don't know what it's going to be called or I don't know how far the property boundary is between here and uh and sycamore state park i know sycamore state park's not far away and that's 
I think a two or three thousand acre facility, but this is one day going to be a beautiful natural area in a and you know what in you know in an area that was destined to be a landfill. And when you look at it, you're you're glad to you're you're glad to you're glad to see that it didn't happen because the residents out here, you know, don't deserve it. I talked about you know how typically in these poor black areas they they try and force in things like landfills and homeless shelters, prisons, that kind of stuff. And Trotwoods had its own issues with crime, but the residents, you know, as well as the city council at the time, which was back in 05, 06, back in 05, back in 04, 05, and 06, because there was, it was on the news that when the residents got wind of the plans, they 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 were ready to stop the plan dead in its tracks. They did not want this here. There's a car getting ready to go down the road up that way. First car I've seen. But anyway, that's it for this one, YouTube, from the Great Miami Mitigation Bacon. Soon to be home of a beautiful metro park someday.